guys and we're back with a light Antopia adventure. So basically, I hope you guys are okay after the thunderstorm and heat wave. So like, the ants have been very active actually. So, like, the, the delay was just because the ants weren't doing much, but when the heat hit, oh my god, did they kick, kick off. So basically, remember that? That's got bigger, I think. And the, the amount of eggs the queen has laid is actually unbelievable. Look, look at all that. Now, I've got a pet here. Oh, a water coming out of it. So you see that there? Right there is um, a pea pie at the moment. Basically, they go from baby ant to teenager ant or teen ant. I don't know, the ant, I don't know, I don't, I don't know, whatever you call them, and then to an adult ant. So the teenage ant is when the black spot is that when they're actually pooping their eggs. So that means they're living and breathing animals and, and as the egg. And there's nothing inside the egg, but like bees do that, they cocoon themselves and then they do that. But here, I have no idea what's going on here besides the queen being there. So basically, like, the ants have been really active, so let's check off on what they've been doing. I think, yeah, remember, before, that was... Let me just get my pet. So if you see here, that was all closed off. Oh, and it's came out again. Let me flip it off. So, basically, right where I was, um... Yeah, here it was all covered in the last video about maybe a week ago or something. Well, two weeks. Yeah. So basically, because of all that time, it gave the ants enough time to um develop. But the thunderstorm didn't affect them whatsoever. But the thunderstorm made a bit of a muggy, muggy warm. If you know what I mean. So basically, you've got the ants' eggs up here. Queen is. Clearly, somewhere in this chamber. Because if you remember, that this chamber was just a lonely old chamber. But then, it um eggs sort of being piled up there. But then, that middle chamber was given all the eggs. So I don't really know what they're doing. But oh, never mind. The royalty herself has shown up in the middle of a video. Oh, well, that's good for documentation. So. Queen ant, sir. Ants. Okay. First of all, the ants have got large. Like, there's a lot more of them than. Like, they're just really active, and like, the soldiers have gotten bigger, the queen's gotten skinnier, maybe, I don't know. But the queen's always going to be fat at the abdomen, which is the back of it. But I guess, unless you like the eggs. But like,. There is like dank the colony is just massive. Now if you look carefully, um just before the half term began, um if your half term began when I left, um um around my school there was tons of flying ants and those are called elites and what they do is the male and female elites and like basically they they go away from the colony could bear on it was a warm day so i got that out on uh, the friday maybe i don't know but basically um there was tons of ants flying around and i knew straight away it was a nuptial fight season for these um ants now mine are harvester ants so i don't know what their nuptial fight time is but like they're a harvester Actually, you know, the, the pure harvester. Like, they're not black ants because I think black ants look slightly different with the black. They might have like, different sizes, but I don't know. I just I was told they're harvester ants, so I'm just going to go with that. I'm not going to do any research on like, black ants because like, they'd probably just come up with black garden ant. Like, the most common ant ever. If you live in England. Basically. No, it's like the season started, and what they do, they fly up into the air, the male mates with the female, 
But then Ember Mail died because he's pretty useless now. Well, his only purpose was to um fertilize the queen or the future queen, and then um she would find an area, dig a burrow, and lay her first eggs. So, a month, a month or a few, I guess later, and the first workers would emerge in in a ghostly pale looking colour, actually see through. Then after that, um. They would obviously be kind of. I don't, I don't think it's slave, but not more worker, workers for the queen. And then after that, the colony would just develop. But ant keepers tend to catch them before, otherwise, the queen could die. If she, Once she gets her first um, few ants, she gets really lazy. And then she never comes out the um, burrow. And like they build around her, and she will move around, like transfer nests, but. She won't really. She's just too lazy to do anything because she's constantly, because she's constantly laying eggs for the colony to keep on going. Because from I, what I've examined, ants, I was wrong. Ants do not live a month. I think it's, I think it's a year, not a month. And that explains like how big they are now. But basically, Mel, mate. F Mates with the female, the male dies because he's useless. Female finds it, finds a place to nest or attempts to nest. But then ant keepers or like ant foragers go around and pick up the queen and kind of care for her. Sometimes they sell them on, sometimes they keep them as their own. And to be fair, I've been inspired by ant YouTubers. So like people who take care of ants and sometimes it's not just ants sometimes it's like fish or I don't know some ants eat cockroaches I'm like I got to be pretty vile to do that but I could eat, eat ants just eat some seeds so yeah so, so yeah I think that's going to be the end of the video these videos aren't going to be long because it's not really like obviously it's just to talk about but I feel like it would be pointless just jabbering on about random stuff but in the next, like, and there's also um, and black the and black market. But we'll talk about that in the next video. So like and subscribe if you like the content, and I'll see you soon. Bye.